Uh, no, my family's never been paid for a Kentucky Fried Chicken ad, except for when Colonel Sanders himself was doing the ads and Uncle Jim were doing the ads. Other than that, those are the only two family members that ever got any payment for marketing. In the early 2000s, late 1990s, when the cartoon Colonel was coming out, we didn't get any royalties off of that. There's no reason for us to, because Uncle Harley sold the rights to use his name and image in the brand's company's marketing relinquishing any royalties that the family would ever get and the royalties wouldn't even come to me or my side of the family it would go to his children and grandchildren if there were any but they didn't get anything either none of the advertisements uh, nobody who does the advertisements ask is there a family around that would be offended by this is this a little insensitive to the family that's never asked that's never discussed they just do what they do they sometimes it's good sometimes it's really embarrassing sometimes it's really insensitive but I do have to thank Kentucky Fried Chicken because if they weren't so insensitive in the past, I wouldn't be sitting here today educating so many people on my family history. I wouldn't be learning what I have learned about the company and my family history and how they operate today. I would probably still just have some sour feelings with them about their quality in Bradenton, Florida. But other than that, I wouldn't have gotten into it as much as I have. So we have to thank Kentucky Fried Chicken for doing what they do because it inspired me to do what I do.